Lynch syndrome is one of the more common and, and better studied of the hereditary cancer syndromes. People with Lynch syndrome have uh, much higher lifetime cancer risks than other people walking down the street. The main cancer risks are uh, for tumors of the GI tract, the digestive tract, uh, mainly colon cancer, and then women with Lynch syndrome also have high lifetime risks of cancers of the reproductive system, so um, uterine, endometrial, ovarian cancers. In this condition, there is a specific genetic cause, a mutation um, that we know leads to the disease, and this mutation can be passed from, from parent to child. A parent with a mutation, a Lynch syndrome mutation, has a 50-50 shot of passing it on to each of their children. There are certain red flags that um, clinicians will, um, will see in a family and a personal history that um, will be suspicious for Lynch syndrome, but the really the gold standard for diagnosing the condition is with genetic testing. And um, genetic testing really plays a central role in, in the diagnosis and treatment of Lynch syndrome because once we identify a mutation in a family, we can easily test other family members and, and get the appropriate screening um, and medical management going before they develop cancer. So when it's used appropriately, genetic testing um, for Lynch syndrome has, has a very good uh, possibility of actually uh, saving lives. Lynch syndrome, of course, is a, a, difficult, uh, a difficult diagnosis to come to terms with for these families, um, but the silver lining is that we've known about the condition for decades now, which in the context of hereditary cancer testing is a really long time. And, and over those years, we've made tremendous uh, progress in uh, not only new techniques for identifying these families, but also um, wonderful research that's been done as to how to treat these families effectively. So we're at a point now where if you find uh, a mutation in a family and that confirms a diagnosis of Lynch syndrome, we can get on, on more aggressive screening protocols to detect these tumors at early treatable stages. The Lynch syndrome testing that we offer at Ambry has, has really evolved throughout the years um, in, in, in response to the research that's been done. So we started offering the test um, years ago and we were testing for three genes at the time because that's what was known. We, we knew that three genes caused Lynch syndrome um, and now we test for five. So as, as this research has been done and uh, these groups have discovered different types of mutations that can cause Lynch, um, new genes, as I mentioned, um, different ways that we can improve our, our tests. We always um, dedicate a lot of resources to incorporating that research um, quickly into something uh, that can be offered clinically to these patients. Our goal is always to have the most comprehensive testing available um, to give these patients that are sent to us the best chance of finding an answer. And, when it comes down to it, that's really what genetic testing is all about. It's helping people find answers.